Hello everybody, it's Jacob from Happy Shrimp House. This is my first video in the current year because unfortunately in the past few months I was too busy for not taking any videos. I was busy with my life, with my work, with my business as well. It was growing very, very fast. Uh, at this moment I had like a 1500 to the customers with the 600 returning the customers, which make me very happy. This uh, video is going to be about the just a quick uh, view of my tanks plus what's new in my store. Okay, let's go. The start from the very top, it's about the 60 liters uh, on the platinum soil um, with a GH5 um, 150TDS with the black and the red nanashi. Yeah, the, the tank is full of the babies, but unfortunately I can't see because they're hiding in the bush. They are somewhere and okay the next tank beside sorry for the uh sun reflex if my this tank is with my orange eye tigers on the platinum soil ph about the six uh on the gh5 150 tds um yeah it's about the 10 12 streams plus five females uh was carry the eggs was make me very, make me very happy nothing happened apart the colony just growing below this tank is uh, on the master soil ph about the 5.9 where the blue steel used to be blue steel but now is uh, full of everything peach yellowish some gray some green for example this one is very nice shrimp at the shrimp tank, as you can see, is full of the babies, so full of the young shrimps, and uh, yeah, can't complain. GH4, GH4 with the 250, 125, 150 TDS, sorry guys, and as you can see, the shrimps are very active, they're taking the food, but I just dropped the food like a few seconds, few minutes, sorry, ago. Uh, next tank beside it's uh, with my tank tie tigers on the platinum soil pH about a 6.1 with the GH4 it's mean about the 120 130 uh, TDS with the mineralizator a uh, GH plus one tiger they look stunning tank full of the young shrimps babies can't complain Hey, show up some black as you can see maybe here oh yeah some looks like a tiger pinto I don't know where it comes from but I, uh, I don't care <laughs> next tank below it's uh, with my galaxy galaxy tigers black hey, some few reds it's a waste tank after my boas the tanks the shrimps looks amazing as you can see very active to take the food as a cheeky as always on the platinum soil gh5 with the 150 tds 150 tds very nice tank next tank beside it's with the red galaxy with a few uh, red snowflakes on the platinum soil pH 6.2 roughly GH5 conductivity about 130 TDS as you can see tank is a full of the young of the babies as well the colony growing very fast and in next few months I need to start with some selection for I take like a few nice snowflakes and put them in another tank below it's a tank on the master soil ph above the six zero mm, with my galaxy tigers as a nice few boss as you can see yeah i'm doing the selection uh, all the hints streams with i'm not happy i'll just put it above in my galaxy uh, tank 
as I said, on the master soil pH 6.0, conductivity about 150, and the GH plus one tiger, uh, pH about 6.2. Yeah. And next tank was my favorite tank. Looks stunning, amazing. Sorry for my shaking hands. And so it red Taiwans. On the bottom F soil pH about the 5.7 conductivity about 120 on a GH plus LC low conductivity and uh, yeah I'm so happy and next tank is beside with my fancy tiger nothing impressive but as you can see few babies actually lots of babies young shrimps the colony growing fast as well yeah this is my overview on my rack uh, sorry focus where are you okay then on my stock just the boxes <laughs> and uh, as you can see the fertilizers uh phosphorium carbo uh iron micro for the plants Nitrogen fertilizer, duran N, uh, potassium, green N, KH Boulder, GH plus one for the mineralizer for the RO water and for the shrimps. My favorite mineralizer, GH one, GH plus one for a dedicated for a tiger species. As you can see, I'm keeping on the GH5, some tanks on the GH4, amazing. Uh, next one is a KH plus for Sulawesi shrimps, uh, is for the pH buffer. GH plus for a Sulawesi, just for a buffer, the general hardness. Uh, GH plus LC long conductivity, dedicated for a NAB uh, species. Uh, trace one shrimps. Uh, some sponge filters uh, 3d nets as you can see also feeders bottom feeders glass feeders wait where are you going and yeah my other cuton by enzyme mostly is a, a bacters ps bacter by enzyme by immuno uh, multi powder for the beginners as a good next it's a new product shrimp bacter for the beginners as well uh, as good i just tested i'm so impressed uh, uh rich one it's a fluvic acid sorry focus okay as you can see amino acid fluvic acid vitamins micro elements and the bio bio probiotic it's a reproduction a reproduce booster mm, bio nitro for the start the, the for the start the tanks planted fish tanks shrimp tanks and there is a <laughs> biobacter food krill algae breeds green muscle mold it's a new you can use the mold instead of the vital there is a vital instead of the vital vital white dedicated for the white shrimps uh benefits uh mineral rocks myron acuton mold morilonid this, uh, this is in the powders new and um, new 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 med med media filter cube one I'll show you later how it looks like more mineral rocks hyper pore prime pore filter media this is a uh, Hamburg filter spot for a uh, Hamburg filtration this one is good it's Fluidized moving bed with filter media just for the oxygen booster double sponge uh, filter with a prime pore the cubes as you can see some catapa leaves under gravel filters master soil normal bottom F soil where they keep in the pH about the 5.5 5.8 roughly Amazing stuff for a bee species. Powder, 
the mustard soil, three liters powder, normal platinum soil, more platinum soil than the powder, and the mustard soil. Okay, next uh, in next part of the video, I will show you. I uh, will present the new products. I'm gonna have a word we word about and then see you later. Hi guys, again in the second part of my video. Now I'm gonna say a few words about the new products. Let's go from the food food names uh, malt malt dead food helping malt in the shrimps and uh, you can use instead of the another quadro food very popular vital this food all the foods is available with the 30 grams tube or the or the 10 grams uh, next one next product it's a brand new product names shrimp bacta it's uh, very good for the for the start mm, it's dedicated for the start of the mm, tanks with the shrimps it's the same as multi powder basically it's almost this um, very similar products but this one multi powder is dedicated for the mm, for the rich soil as a uh, amazonia or master soil or platinum soil both products has various cultures various of the of the bacteria including prebiotics this one also uh, helping remove uh, NO2 and NH3 as, as ammonia and nitrates also helps remove the hydrogen sulfides yeah this one is for a rich soil shrimp back there is most similar but this one also removed uh, helps remove the waste of the organic waste and also helps remove the waste after the, the shrimp, uh, sorry, the shrimps for the shrimps food. For example, if you overdose the food, just once per week, have the remove all the waste, um, contaminate uh, waste of the food. Uh, both both bacters, it's recommended just just for the beginners. Very easy to use. Also can be used in the first few weeks as a food for the for the shrimps. Also newborn shrimps babies all the adults next product it's a new a new media filter i'm trying i'll maybe next few weeks i'll prepare another video uh, about the quadruple media let's open up the cube it's as a name set is a cubes size one inch one inch and about the one inch very good for the um, under gravel filters also can be used in canister canister as well and what is a very important uh, all quad drop media doesn't affect at all ph of the water in our tanks and Actually, guys, that's it. I hope this short video will be helpful. If you have any questions, please let me know. Just send a message or drop the email or comment below the video. Thanks for watching and see you next time. All the best, guys. Bye.